the wildly popular tale of Keanu Reeves refusing to accept the Whoopi Goldberg Award is completely untrue. A widely shared tweet purports that Keanu Reeves, the actor, has declined to present Whoopi Goldberg with an award. However, there isn't a shred of proof that the narrative is real. Breaking news, Whoopi Goldberg's Lifetime Achievement Award refused to be given by Keanu Reeves because she's not a good person do you think he's right or wrong? The tweet on Friday was sent out by Punchy Plays. As of the time of writing, the bogus tweet had received over 2 million views on X, the website that was once known as Twitter. It was sent on Friday. Users can provide corrections or context through X's Community Notes fact-checking initiative. However, there hasn't been a response to this specific tweet yet. The bogus story seems to have come from the Dunning-Kruger Times website. However, the Dunning-Kruger Times isn't a trustworthy information source. Actually, the website exists solely to deceive users into disseminating misleading information. In psychology, the term Dunning-Kruger effect really relates to the idea that certain individuals with low IQs tend to overestimate their own cognitive capacities. In recent years, a number of articles from the Dunning-Kruger Times have gone viral, one of which stated that KitchenAid was removing all of its items from Target. When the article was released, Target's LGBT pride displays had some conservatives infuriated. Naturally, though, the story was untrue. Governor Greg Abbott of Texas even distributed a phony item from the Dunning-Kruger Times from the previous year that purportedly stated Garth Brooks had been heckled off stage during a performance in Texas. Strangely, according to the Dunning-Kruger Times piece, Brooks has been playing in a fictional city in Texas called Hamberston. This is a strange detail considering that you would think the governor of Texas would be able to identify a fictitious city name in the state he is in charge of. Why this bogus news website is using Keanu Reeves and Whoopi Goldberg is not immediately apparent. But as musician Taylor Swift can attest, no superstar is safe in today's media landscape.